ready for june 2020 net examination so here are some of the most important questions from your environmental section that were part of your december paper so the very first question talks about un champions earth award that was given to prime minister and cochin international airport now cochin international airport was given this award based on its entrepreneurship vision uh, basically the whole of the airport has been running entire operations on solar energy and this is one of the reasons why it was given this award so very very important question the next question talks about the sustainable development goals now we have already covered one of the lectures on sustainable goal and there we have seen zero hunger quality education clean water and climate action are four of the goals that have been discussed in the sustainable development goals with a target of 2030 so these four are the right options we have also devised a mnemonic to help you learn the, uh, the sustainable development goals each of the paper both in june 2019 and december 2019 had questions on sustainable development goal or millennium development goal or national action plan on climate change so three of these topics become very very important the next is montreal protocol again we have covered a complete class on montreal protocol and this is related related to phasing out the consumption of ozone depleting substances very very important similar to the montreal protocol you do have kyoto protocol and that's for the greenhouse gases so very very important also cover one of the classes that we have taken on 30 the environmental conventions another very important lecture so here we have another question on kyoto protocol now kyoto protocol was committed for a period of 2008 to 2012 so this is the line or the timeline that has been given and six main greenhouse gases have been given which include carbon dioxide you have methane nitrous oxides hydrofluorocarbons then you have perfluorocarbons and sulfur hexoxide so these are the six important gases that have been discussed under kyoto protocol which have been considered as uh, the greenhouse gases important for discussion under kyoto protocol now the postal material covers all these details in a third a uh, thorough fashion the next is the potential geothermal power uh, potential in india is approximately it's around 20 gigawatts or we can say 10000 megawatts now what are the areas you have the himalayan belt then you have the regions of kambe uh, narmada son tapti river then you have godavari mahanadi which are pockets of geothermal energy in india geothermal basically means thermal means heat geo means earth so the heat energy coming from the earth simply put is the geothermal energy which could be used for a lot of purposes and again uh, this geothermal energy do is believed to have medicinal properties as well the next question is cystomasis is one of the common water contact disease which is spread by now the correct answer is amoeba usually uh, people engaged in activities with agriculture industry or swimming or infested water get through this disease and it is uh, either intestinal or urogenital so uh, two of the pathways through which this disease is spread a very very important question a burning topic from your environment and this was part of the down to earth we have been covering down to earth fortnightly so again becomes very very important the next question is again very important now what is important to understand is there is no sound drop or decrease per meter that is seen so we get a sound drop of nearly 6 db when we are doubling the distance so it's nothing to do from the uh, distance from the so uh, sound source okay so first option becomes incorrect definitely material with high surface uh, or den mass density are good noise barriers and a sound pressure of 2 mu pascal corresponds to 0 decibel that is correct because this corresponds to nearly 20 into 10 raised to power minus 6 pascals which is considered as a res reference level or a 0 decibel level so b and c are the correct statements here very very important question the next is the correct order or the sequence of global warming potential a very important question so make sure global warming potential is a very upcoming topic and every time you have at least one question so refer a separate class on global warming potential for the same now the increasing order is you have one global warming potential for 
carbon dioxide followed by uh, methane which is around 28 to 36 then you have nitrous oxides and the highest is for cfc so this becomes your right order for your greenhouse uh, the global warming potentials the gpw that is called as uh, sorry, G, uh, GWP, okay. The next is, which of the following statements are correct that you have to find out. Now, Millennium Development Goals have to be achieved by 2015 and Sustainable Development Goals from 2015. 2016 till 2030 so both this statement and this statement are correct the sustainable policy goals would be guided till 2030 not 35 so this is a incorrect statement so again as i said a lot of questions from sustainable development goal millennium development goals a little variation of these questions was seen we will be covering each of these uh, topics that were there across all the 10 sets that were asked in heading to heading basis so all the 10 units of the paper one would be covered and definitely the details for our online classes are given in the description below so just have a look onto the description below for more details in any doubts any questions feel free to drop an email to admin at exam race for further queries have a wonderful day ahead